Good morning, California Seismic Air friends. Earlier this morning, we had a wake up call of a 4.0 earthquake that was given to some of you here in the greater Los Angeles area at least. It was preceded by a smaller 3.34 shock. And as I just was getting ready to report on this foreshock, a larger shock started to happen. And here's the following live recording of that moment. I hope you guys all had a wonderful Sunday Easter. It is today, the April 5th. And oh, and we are just experiencing a larger quake right now which is going to run over the smaller quake where is this one happening okay i was just going to report on our earlier quake at 4 15 this morning and as i am starting this recording we are experiencing definitely a larger quake and it's still going where is this located at so the earlier quake was definitely on the Newport Inglewood Fault. It was actually just a mile east northeast of Lenox, uh, which is located um, between Inglewood and Hawthorn. Right here is Lenox, Lenox Park. So and this quake is definitely much larger that is happening now. It's still going. Let's see if we can find out if it is in the same general location. Let me go to the fault zone here on the map. We'll take a look at that. This is the Newport Inglewood Fault. The earthquake, uh, the first one happened right here. There is our notification of this quake. Let's go take a quick look at that. We'll go into live here and it's showing a four. Okay. So we might just probably say this might have been the four shock to this quake right now let's look at that there it is and it sure was also right above lennox there lennox park okay so we had a four shock now we know we had a four shock of a 3.4 and now we have a 4.0 main shock let's hope we keep it by this this is also showing up on our new uh, crestline seismograph as a matter of fact uh, this one before that was also showing up here as a smaller quake and just barely made an image but this 4.0 is clearly showing up so it's clearly um, a much larger quake it's uh, point out as a 4.1 right now uh, same location and we had a foreshock of uh, a 3.3 as a matter of fact that was. So now the USGS reported that the earthquake did not originate from a specific named fault. And it was unusually deep, uh, this quake, about 20 kilometers. Furthermore, the odds are that nothing bigger will happen. So that's a good thing. But for us here at California Seismograph, it is a reminder that mother nature is unpredictable and we need to be prepared for all types of disasters. So this is why we here at California Seismic Lab call action to our TIP standard. Check up on your disaster kits, make family uh, communication plans and be trained for earthquakes and disasters and teach and share with others. Now, we are glad that you join us here. It's been rather busy, obviously, on our live site. If you are not familiar with our live site, we are recording live earthquakes happening from two different drums and several e-graphs that are an invention by California Seismograph. You can find us at californiaseismograph.com. It's our store, but you can also find us on YouTube at California Seismograph Live directly on YouTube. If you enjoy our site, then please give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to get more information, hit the bell notification and please subscribe so you can support us that way. We greatly appreciate your time. Have a fantastic day. We talk to you soon. Bye-bye.